and check out my motorbike app. Hope you like it. I'm a mix of a fighter pilot and a cyclist. Never mind physics, because I find it a little inapplicable. Right when I fly, limits never reply. And the seventh is I'm not gonna be the first daredevil to die. My hell is a temperate climate, so I'm revving on the engine just to get the freaking temperature rising. Hello again, YouTube. This is Beanie Bum. Welcome back to another episode of Trials Evolution Gold Edition. Yay! This game is fun. I don't know why I took such a long break from it, but not now. I was kind of debating like whether I should record uh, uh, this or Fallout New Vegas, and I know I haven't recorded Fallout New Vegas in a really long time, but like. It's just, it's because, like, I recorded a really long episode and then all the files got corrupted. But whatever, that's okay. Alright, we beat, we, we've done everything on here, so let's go over to the HD warehouse. So I was like, I'll do this. This is, this is fun. Alright, Rise and Fall by, by, uh, Graywell and Pegboard Nerds. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> alright, let us go with the Phoenix. We don't even need to think about what bike we're choosing because the Phoenix is just so good. I used to be a, uh, a man about the, uh, the... The one before it. What was it? The scorpion? I think so. Why did I do that? That was that was dumb. Whoops. Whoops. Oh my gosh. I almost just pressed escape R because I thought <laughs> the, Yep, I'm playing Happy Wheels. No. <laughs> but yeah, I used to be a scorpion man. Um, but then I tried out the Phoenix Evo and I was like, this is a lot better. What what, what was I thinking? I like these hill climbs though. They're nice. Um yeah, I'm thinking about getting trials fusion. What do you guys think? Oh, <laughs> smooth beanie. Um, it looks good, but I don't know. I mean, this the futuristic stuff. Is it gonna be all like like in the tricks? I don't know about the tricks, man. Is that just something else I need to worry about upon completion? Or are they gonna make me like do tricks so I can get past certain things? I don't know if that would be a good thing, something I would like or not. But probably would be because I like trials. <laughs> and I'm sure they would do a good job with it. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> get up there, dude. You can do it. Oh gosh, oh, yeah. so I kind of like just woke up like <laughs> 15 minutes ago, so pardon if I sound all, yeah, I, I, I am pretty sure I sound the same, but whatever, it's okay, I feel good, I feel well rested, I got very good sleep, how's your, how's your uh, weekend going so far, uh, it's Sunday for me, it might be like Monday for you, because I know US is like behind everyone else in terms of time zone, why can't I get up there anymore, I just gotta rev it, I just gotta go, 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 go! Oh my gosh! Why can I not get up there anymore? I was getting up there fine to begin with. Why is it not? <laughs> yeah, there we go. Okay, golly, that was rough. Alright, let's get up here. This should be easy. Oh, yeah, feather it. Feather the gas. Feather the throttle. Feather the throttle! <laughs> no! It's okay. It's okay. Just get your bearings back. We'll go. We didn't have time to get our bearings back, but that's fine. No! Oh, you make it! No! <laughs> I might as well just restart. I am getting a little bit sick though, um, so that's kind of stupid. It's just a little bit of a cough, and I had migraines yesterday, and I accidentally like overdosed on, on like migraine medicine because <laughs> Excedrin, like extreme migraine medicine, you're supposed to only take two capsules per day, and I accidentally took four. Uh, <laughs> so I was kind of afraid, but I'm fine. I'm good. Nothing bad happened. Oh gosh. Okay, good. Cause I like I take it in doses of two, which might be bad, cause you probably only are supposed to take like one or something. Oh, good job, Beanie. Very smooth. But yeah, one just doesn't do it for me. Oh my goodness. Land it. Absorb the impact with your knees. You didn't, and now you don't have a crotch. No. Ah. Okay. Let's take our time down this. Okay, oh my gosh, I'm restarting. I'm sorry, I wanna get the gold. I wanna go for the gold. It's gold or home. Oh, that didn't rhyme. It rhymed in my head at first, but I don't know what I was thinking. All right, we are going good. Look at this smoothness. Okay, of course, of course. I always jinx myself whenever I say that I'm doing good. Let's try that again. Okay, good, good, slow, and accelerate right here. Good, perfect. Okay, that's how you're supposed to do it. You accelerate like last second. All right. Oh, procrastination is key, children. Just kidding. No, it isn't. Oh, gosh. Whoa. Whoa, yeah. Nice. I wasn't expecting to make that one. All right, a little bit faster, please. Thank you very much. All right, slow. No. Whoa. No, what? I crashed. My mule got lodged into my sternum. That sucks. All right, let's try that again. 
Okay, didn't didn't procrastinate that time. That's why I failed. <laughs> Good life lessons with Speedy Bomb. Procrastinate and you will succeed. <laughs> hey, don't blame me. It's just trials. Trials is teaching me the, the traits of life. All right, let's go down. Good. Oh, snap. Make it. Okay, we're good. No, we're not. Ah, gosh dang it. This is really difficult. They didn't mean, they didn't mean nothing when they said hard. Oh, gosh. Well, I mean, I meant they, they mean everyone. I don't know what I'm saying. Okay, go up here. All right, we're good. 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 Listen to these sick jams. Oh, nice guitar, mate. Skrillex is going to drop the bass soon. I sure hope so. Okay, we're good. Ah, uh, please! Thank you very much. Whoa! Let's see. Okay. Cliff falling. There was a sign there that said that, and I didn't read it. Okay. Oh, bad idea. Oh, no! How did I crash? I was just doing a front flip. I do flips all the time. Look, see? Flip. Probably a bad idea. Oh, gosh. Flip, flip, flip. Oh. Okay. Bad idea. Don't do flips all the time. Just when it's necessary. Okay, good. Go. Yes! Nice. The traction on these wheels is amazing. Okay, we're good. Oh, yeah. Up, up, up. Yeah, look at you and your bad purple self. Okay, go down. Yeah. Okay, just wait a little bit. Just it, absorb the impact with your knees. Good job, sir. That looks a little bit. What the heck? Are you kidding me? Are you serious? How am I? How do they expect me to get up that? Are you kidding me? Okay, this is stupid. <laughs> what? How do they think that's possible? Is that- oh, oh my goodness. I know it's possible, but like, what the heck? Who can actually do that? No one? What the heck? Okay, let's- let's try and think out what we're okay, never mind. Well, we gotta- we gotta plan this out. We gotta be a strategist. We can't just YOLO it like I'm doing right now. We gotta- we gotta- we gotta- we gotta think things out, take things through, be patient with it. We gotta think things out and be patient with things. We gotta- we gotta think things through and not YOLO it like I'm doing right now. Okay, we're good. We're good. I don't know what this voice is. It's kind of annoying, though. <laughs> okay. So, I'm thinking... If I just go vroom vroom vramity vroom right now, I'll make it. Vroom vroom vramity vroom! What the heck? Is that even possible? Or did they just make this level to troll me? Is there any way you can do that? Oh my goodness. All you trials veterans out there are like, yeah man, you just gotta do the secret combination code. Oh my goodness, this is stupid! Ah! I'm gonna beat this level with like 18,000 faults in, in a time frame of 56 minutes. Okay, let's go. Up! Okay, good. No. All right. All right. All right. No. <laughs> Hold on. Just wait a second. Put your brakes on or something. Why don't why isn't there a brake button in this game? Okay. I think I need that drop for the speed. That's what it is. Okay, okay. Let's see. All right. So I got to go real slow. Then I got to get the speed. The speed. The speed. Okay, are you ready? Tuk, 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 tuk. It's like a roller coaster. Up we go. Yay! Wow, that was easier than I thought it was. See, you just gotta think and not YOLO things like I just did right there. I'll absorb the impact with your knees. Excuse me. Okay, up we go. Up we go. Yeah. This is a fun level when you know how to do it right, but that is not me right now. Oh my god. I'm Now that I know how to do it, I'm just gonna restart the whole thing. Because <laughs> I want that silver or gold, whichever one it decides to give it. Or whichever one it thinks I deserve. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, golly gee willikers. Okay. We got this. We just beat, like, the hardest part in this in this level. We can do it just up and slowly. Okay, good. Good job. Good job. Wait, no! <laughs> ah! Okay. Calm down, Mr. Beanie. It's okay. You just need to take your time. Absorb the impact with your knees. It's the important part. And keep going. Only lean when it's necessary. Okay, good, good, good. Okay, so now we go down here with extreme caution and care. Slow down. Slow down. Slow down. You know you cannot catch me. Gas pedal, gas pedal, gas pedal. Okay, up. Oh, cleared it. Super easy now that I know how to do that. Okay, flip for style points and to get over and absorb the impact. Absorb it. No! Ah, I can do this without faults. I knew it. I know I can do this without faults. It's it's possible, and I want the gold. And the gold on this is probably do it without faults because this freaking PC version of the game is super brutal. And like, because uh, the Xbox 360 version of this game, you get golds with like faults galore. But this one, it's like you get zero, you get more, ha a half of a fault. Like <laughs> you don't land properly, and it's like nah, silver, nah, we ain't we ain't gonna give it to you. <laughs> Yeah, Xbox version is a bit easier. Also, you've got that throttle control. Maybe I should just get a uh, 
Maybe I should get, get, get a gamepad for my PC. No! It's keyboard and mouse of life! Or in this case, just keyboard. But whatever. I should probably get one. Because, like, I'm thinking about bu buying Skullgirls, which is an awesome fighting game. And, like, I would need a controller if I wanted to play that. Because I can't play fighting games with a keyboard and mouse. I tried it on, like, some Flash games and it just didn't work. Oh, nice! Did you see that slick recovery? Yeah, you didn't because it didn't exist. <laughs> okay, up. Good. Good. Yeah. No! Ah, uh, this is frustrating. Let's talk about fighting games. Yeah, fighting games are cool. It was actually the, uh, the first genre, I guess, of game. It was the first game type thing I've ever played. Uh, cause the first video game I ever played was Bloody Roar for the PS1. And that was an amazing game. And Bloody Roar 2 came out and that was awesome. And Bloody Roar 3 and I didn't really like it because it wasn't bloody anymore. It, like, they shot out sparks or something, I don't know. And then Bloody Roar 4 came out for the PS, uh, 2 and PS3. And it was amazing. I love Bloody Roar 4, but Bloody Roar 1 will always have a place in my heart with its awesome graphics. <laughs> Ah, oh, yeah, its graphics weren't that good, but it's nostalgic for sure. Okay, and I always used to watch my dad play um, SSX Tricky. <laughs> that was awesome. And uh, Tomb Raider. I would help him out with Tomb Raider and Crash Bandicoot. My sister and I would play that. All right, go up. I oh my goodness gracious, just do it. Cause like I don't know, I was always afraid to play. Cause I only played fighting games for a long time. And I was always afraid to play story games because I felt like I was responsible for the life of the character I was playing. Whereas in fighting games, I thought they were just like, you know, they were duking it out and nothing really bad would happen because it says KO and they don't die. But they die and I was always afraid. Like, video games were like actually one of my biggest fears as a little kid. I don't know if, um, <laughs> if uh, that's a thing. Like, if there's a name, like a type of phobia of video games. But. I remember one time I was playing like inline skating 3 or something like that for the uh, original Xbox and there's a section in the map I always used to play where like I always used to just do the half pipe oh whoa 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 oh no okay we'll do it with one fault but like I always used to do the half pipe session and then oh not enough speed not enough speed no darn it uh, but then I, I strayed off at the half pipe section and I was like ooh what's this there's a graveyard and so I was exploring the graveyard all like wearily and stuff. And then there is like this not scary at all like cartoon 2D ghost thing that was making like a silly face. It wasn't even making a silly face. It was like if you cut holes in a sheet and then that, that it was just flying around a grave. And I got so legitimately afraid that like I didn't I didn't turn off the console or the TV and I didn't move my character out of the way. I was like, you're on your own, dude. And I put the controller down and walked out of the room. <laughs> I was like, what what age was I there? Like like four or something like that? Some 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 age like that. But yeah. Yeah. Like I don't know how that scared me because I wasn't afraid of cartoons with like ghosts in them or something. But maybe it was still just that concept of like I felt like I was in control of the people's lives. Maybe that's why I'm afraid of bugs, too, because I have, like, the most legitimate entomophobia you have ever seen, ever. Like, um, there is this- and entomophobia is the fear of bugs. There was this one time in science class where, like, everyone was quiet and the teacher was, was talking about notes and space and stuff like that. And then, um, I felt something, like, like, as if a hair was touching my arm, and I looked at my arm, and there was the world's smallest ant. Like, it was- it was minuscule. You wouldn't even notice that it was there if you weren't me. Um, but I looked at it, and <laughs> I let out the most pathetic yelp, and I, like, jumped. And everyone, like, everyone in the class, including the teacher, just stopped and looked at me. <laughs> and then the teacher was like, you okay? And I was like, yeah, there was a, there was a bug. <laughs> Yeah, so I have, and, and like I was talking about antipophobia and the connection between me being afraid for lives because bugs are really easy to kill. Like I'm always afraid that I'm just gonna kill one by just stepping on it when walking and I've probably killed like a lot of bugs by just walking, probably hundreds. And like that sucks and maybe that's why I'm afraid. But I am afraid of the bigger bugs and also the ones that have harder shells. So that doesn't seem too logical. Oh gosh, oh nice, up. Oh, like cockroaches. Holy crap, if there is a cockroach in my room right now, I would legitimately stop recording and run out of my house. Like, no joke. 
I actually have done that before. Not not the stop recording part, but gone out of my house because a cockroach was in it. <laughs> and then I remember um, another time there is like a beetle in my old house. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on! There's the finish. Yes, that has to be gold. There's no way. Yeah, awesome, faultless. Heck yes! Wow, my game is on point today. <laughs> But anyways, in my last house, there was a beetle on the floor, and instead of taking care of it like I would nowadays, because I've gotten a little braver, um, I climbed on top of the couch, and I stayed there for a good hour. <laughs> so yeah, that's me and my, my fears. What, what, do you have any phobias? Leave it in the comment section down below. Um, let's do this level. Alright, cool. Yeah, I've got I've got phobias. Uh, I don't have phobias of video games anymore. Actually, um, when it ooh, what's this? This is weird. Um, whoa, god, <laughs> fail instantly. Why don't you? But like when it comes to video horror media, like video games scare me the least. Like horror games, I can handle better than horror movies, and like I can, I handle them worse while I'm doing them. But they don't give me nightmares and like think that there's ghosts in my house afterwards. So. That's cool. I'm not afraid of video games anymore. I'm not afraid of no ghosts. Just kidding. Yes, I am. Okay, let's go. I'm kind of a scaredy cat. Just to, to be honest, it took me a really long time to do a roller coaster with a loop. I think I was like, look at all these freaking flippy doos and, and stuff. This is crazy. I think I was like, uh, oh, stay on it. Oh, smart beanie. You know how the game works. Oh, snap. Uh, let me continue my sentence. I think I was about like, oh snap, yeah, okay, you made a checkpoint, that's fine. I think I was about like <laughs> 12 years old when I went on my first roller coaster with loops, and I've been going to theme parks ever since I can remember. Oh snap, uh, yeah, it was Revolution at Six Flags uh, Magic Mountain in California. What the heck? What the heck? I don't think that was supposed to happen. That's fine. Oh, I know what you're supposed to do there. Okay, I got it, I got it. Okay, okay. Alright, we're good. Ah, ah, crap. Uh, excuse me again. Alright, come on, Vini, fight the sickness and fight the wheel. Come on, you got this. You got this. Yeah, no! All of that, are you kidding me? Oh my god, I'm gonna. Oh, that is, that is annoying. That is 100% annoying. Alright, I'm gonna stay back so when the time comes, I can just roll up. Roll up. And go! Yeah! Yeah! Nice! Made it! This is the most unstable map in the planet. I just called it a map. We're not playing Call of Duty here. This is the most unstable level in the planet. Whoa! That was really cool! Can I do it again? Ow! Golly! Gee willikers! Look at my faults! I've got seven of these. I might have to do this level again later, but I don't wanna. This is, uh... There's no way you can do this without faults on your first try, unless you're too good, which I am apparently not. This is difficult. This is stupid. Okay, make it up. Do the backflip. do do. Okay, now we go. We bounce off of this and faceplant, apparently. No, we're okay. Go. We're good. Okay, bounce off of this and then down there. Good. Perfect. That's how you're supposed to do it. Oh, no. Balls. Are you kidding me? Okay, this level is really, 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 really difficult. Ah! I saved his life. I saved his life before he could witness death. Okay, we're good. And go! And go! And go! <laughs> ah, this is... Oh my goodness, this is really weird and very difficult. All of these balls and bouncy things. I am on a dirt bike. What do you expect from me? Okay, can't just rush it. You gotta... You gotta take it slow and steady. That one's the race in this situation. Alright, let's go over a bit. Oh, okay. Good. Good. How do they expect me to do this? Like this? Like this? Okay, 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 okay. Nice. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh my gosh! It just hit me how mad I am right now. <laughs> ah! Okay. I think I'm gonna rage quit. <laughs> this is so. I can't do it. Watch. Just um, it take. I think it's the fact that it takes a lot of patience, and I'm not a patient person right now. Wait a minute. Hold on. Did I just? Oh no. Okay, I didn't make it. <laughs> Okay, well, I'm gonna I'm gonna end it here. <laughs> I know it came on quickly. It was like a it was like a rage sneak. It just came up and bit me in the butt. But oh yeah, I can't I can't I I'll, I'll come back to that later. I'm not on point. I just hit the microphone. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right. Well, I don't know how long we've been recording, but it feels like we've been recording for a good while. 
Uh, <laughs> if you liked the episode, please be sure to leave a like down below. Thank you very, very, very much for watching all the way through. I very much appreciate it. Um, leave a comment down below on whatever you want to or whatever I asked you to leave a comment down below. And have a very nice day. I will see you all later. Goodbye.